Sean. And Ben. In today's show, we have highlights of the pep rally. This is Teacher, teacher Appreciation Week. We also have your sports and weather reports for this week. And GPA TV starts right now. Now, the MS Pep Rally review from last week. Shots were taken by Ruben Figueroa. Remember, GPA TV Clubs, your application for the last Food Frenzy are due this Friday, May 10th. Food Frenzy will be on May 27th from 4.30 to 7.30. Today, we will have GPA TV celebrating Teachers Appreciation Week. Here at GPA TV, we're going to have a report on Mr. Lumino, our beloved math teacher, Nathan Burnett, reported this story. This is what we call an exact solution. So math. Leave it as math is very important for you to five. use because if it is used in everyday math life. Solution, math you also you teaches four, you how to use your critical times, thinking skills one, here four, at Gohami. Many teachers so are qualified to teach us this, one of them being so Mr. Four, Luminal. Eight, Hi, my name is Chris, and what I think about Mr. Luminal is he's a good and chill teacher. He really doesn't pressure any kids. Um, he's just nice and all, and really, really good teacher. Okay, I think Ms. Luminal is a great teacher. Um, it's about his students and he helps them whenever they need help. My name is Gilbert Duarte. Um, I think Mr. Luminal is a great teacher. Um, he's not really strict like most other teachers. Um, he teaches well. I learned a lot of new stuff from him. Yeah. All right, Mr. Lumino, he's just a really cool teacher. He's really chill. Um, he's he never like forces you to do anything, or like he he lets you try something new. And he's just a really calm and good teacher overall. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. What 
what do I like the most about teaching? Um, I like coming to work because I enjoy working with kids. I enjoy teaching kids. I enjoy messing around with kids. Not in a bad way, but in a good way. I like to joke around with them. I like to teach math. And uh, I hope they enjoy being with me as well. Um, I just enjoy being around kids. Next question. Biggest weaknesses as a teacher? I think... Um, my biggest weakness as a teacher, gosh, I don't know. I don't think I have one. I think I'm pretty darn good. Um, I think there is though, but I have to think about it. Let me see my biggest weakness, probably because I can, I can be a little bit relaxed as a teacher. I, you know, I'm too friendly maybe. Um, you know, I have to kind of, I don't know. What do you think, Nathan? What do you think my biggest weakness as a teacher is? He doesn't know. I don't get? know either. So I'll have to get back to you on that well, one. But I think I do get a little bit more relaxed as a teacher. I get too relaxed. Maybe that's my biggest weakness. Not sure. Next question. Like hardest period to teach. I would say the end of the day would be the hardest period to teach because we're tired. As teachers, we're tired. Because you guys, you can get on my nerves and so we're tired. And you guys got to know that as students. You get tired too, we get so tired too. Yes, so, you know, probably the, you the beginning of the period or the beginning of the day is easiest, but then the hardest, up. it would be probably the end of the day. That's it. Like, if I wasn't teaching, like if I were to take a day off, I'd probably go surfing. <laughs> Or, so do yeah, I don't like to stay just in one place too long. Like, I don't like to stay at home. The, so, um, I'm pretty active. Y so, y I'm probably going to do fun. something more fun than what I'm doing right now in class. As you can see, Mr. Limitao is an awesome teacher who is very nice, chill, and overall just a great teacher. If you get him in 8th grade, you won't regret having him. All right, go homie. This has been Nathan Burnett for GPA TV. Wow, Mr. Limitao is a great teacher. I know, right? To continue our celebration of our teachers, here is another news story on Mr. Tenney, the PE teacher, filmed by Michael Moyer. Now roll the tape. PE, we all have to take it in 6th, 7th, and 9th grade. In class, we learn about different sports, learn about the physical body, teamwork, and communication. Mr. Tenney is one of, is one of the PE teachers here at Wahomey. Let's go check it out. My name is Mr. Tenney. I teach PE here, 7th and 9th grade. I became a PE teacher. Um, I have one teacher, or I had one teacher in uh, high school who made a large impact on me. He was a coach and a teacher that I had multiple times in high school. And uh, he just showed me that uh, become a teacher, you can make a, a big difference in students' lives. And he was very in influential to, to me. I think my fastest mile was right around six minutes, um, and I, I don't think we we did the pacer back then, or, um, or I don't remember, but that, that was my fastest mile time, just above six minutes, I think. Um, my educational background, I, I went to Carlsbad High School, then I went to a few different universities, but uh, graduated from San Diego State, and that's where I got my teaching credential from as well, and then I'm currently getting my master's uh, online right now. As you can see, Mr. Tenney is a great teacher who is nice, caring, and includes himself in activities and games with, throughout the class. If you are lucky enough to have him for your PE teacher, you will have a fun time in his class. This is Adam Tenney, Mr. Tenney to you students, signing out. And now for our weekly weather report with Quat Dow. Yeah, let's hope for some more sunny days. What's up, Gohomi? I am Quat with your weekly weather. Today's weather is going to be cloudy, so I suggest that you wear a light sweater. The rest of the week will be partly cloudy and in the mid 60s and the early 70s. Well, well, me. this has been Quat for GPA TV Weather. Wonder what sports is up to. 
Wow, I wonder if the Trailblazers are still winning. Now a weekly sports report with Cameron Harrington. What's up, Gohomi? Cam the Man here, back with your weekly GPA TV Sports. For people who are interested in volleyball, there will be open gym volleyball for all middle school students from 3.15 to 5 o'clock in the gym. Now on to the NHL playoffs. The Carolina Hurricanes face off the Boston Bruins today at 5 o'clock p.m. The NBA playoffs are here. I wonder who will make it to the finals. An upcoming game is Friday. It's game six, Milwaukee Bucks versus the Boston Celtics. It's going to be a great game. This has been Cameron for GPA TV signing out. That's all for your Go Home Your Weekly News. This has been Sean. And this has been Ben. Spoiler alert, Aquaman drowns in Avengers Endgame. Have, Have a, a good, good week, week. Go Home